Hi everyone, my name is Olga Kingsbury. I'm a career coach from the Korean Professional Development Center. I'm very excited to be introducing you to our center today uh, and tell you how we can support you in your academic and career journey that's starting now. Our office provides career development services to students at every step of their journey. In the College of Engineering, we have two coaches that work specifically with the College of Engineering students. That's myself, and Amanda Beardle. Amanda Beardle is a wonderful coach. Uh, between the two of us, we split all the coaching focuses within engineering. So I work primarily with computer science, um, computer and electrical engineering, and biomedical engineering students, while Amanda works with all other engineering uh, specialties within the course engineering. Now, if you're a mechanical engineering student, for example, that does not mean that you cannot meet with me or any other coach uh, in our center. You are not limited in your choices of a career coach, so feel free to check our web website and read our bios and pick a coach that you like. Now, uh, there are three things that uh, you could start doing right now as you are starting your uh, academic journey, not waiting until you are graduating to set you up for your career success. And those things are getting to know yourself, making connections, and getting out there. A career journey starts with knowing yourself, your interests, and your values. Are you in the right place? And it's okay to not know because there's so many opportunities out there in the world uh, that are open to you. Um, it's okay to not know right now, but starting to think, starting to evaluate the experiences you are um, getting in and outside of your classes is a great idea to get to know yourself better. At this stage, our office can support you in figuring out um, things that you want or don't want to be doing. Come see myself or Amanda or any other coach for a career exploration appointment uh, where we can uh, explore what's out there in the world of engineering and beyond. We also have a number of great assessments in our center uh, that can help you identify your strengths, values, and interests. Uh, it's important to know those because if you are able to clearly articulate them to your recruiters, that gives you a great advantage uh, as you are um, trying to get internships and uh, jobs later on. Now, don't stress out if you feel like you don't know yourself, you don't know what you're doing, and you don't know what your strengths are. This is very normal for students as they are starting college. It is our job to help you uh, explore yourself and also navigate this career journey and also enjoy the process. Making connections. We keep hearing that networking is uh, really important in, in your career, but why is it really so? Uh, did you know that 80% of jobs are filled even before they are posted. So they are filled by the system that is called internal referrals. That's when an employee recommends someone they know to a recruiter for a job opening. So what does that mean for you? The more people you know, the better chances are that someone is going to help you along the way of finding your internship or a job. Also, don't forget that people are your most valuable resource. One conversation um, can change your path entirely because there are opportunities there that neither you nor us career coaches are aware of. So it's really important to engage in those conversations. Um, think for a moment, what connections do you already have? And you may think that, oh, I'm just starting college. I don't really have a ton of connections. And that's not true. You, are already, you already have your advisors, your classmates, your career coaches, um, and they are a great uh, start to your network. Be proactive about talking to these people, starting conversations, introducing yourself, because your faculty and advisors are usually the first people to know of really great internship and job opportunities, because employers reach out to them directly 
So if an advisor or if a faculty member knows who you are, that you're open to those opportunities and that you're looking for an internship or a job, they're very likely to recommend you for that opportunity. Uh, so one thing that you could do today is start your LinkedIn profile and um, add the people from the you that you are already know. Well, for example, feel free to add me to your um, profile, right? So that's one little step that you can start um, doing today that is going to bring you closer to a successful career. Getting out there. It's um, important to experiment while you're in college because you won't know what you like or what you want, what career you want to pursue um, unless you try it, right? Unless you try different jobs, different careers. Um, and it's really important to um, get yourself to those opportunities that connect you to internships and potential jobs. Uh, in our center, we can do that by putting together hiring events or employer info sessions, employer panels, the, the goal of which is to connect you directly to um, you know, those people who are hiring uh, to learn more about um, different careers. Now, during normal times, uh, when we were all on campus, we used to have a big career fair. We would invite employers to our space to talk to students, to give information sessions. Uh, now we're still going to uh, engage employers and connect you with really great companies. The format is going to be a little different, right? So we are currently operating online, but that does not mean that uh, we're not connecting you to those uh, wonderful organizations. We're still doing this. Uh, it's just happening remotely. So it's important for you to keep track of what's going on in our career center if you go to Handshake. Uh, and I'm going to talk about it a little later. Handshake is our internal job search, job and internship search platform, where you can find internships and jobs, but also kind of keep track of all the events, all the career related events that are happening on campus uh, through our office or beyond our office. Um, now, you may think that, okay, I really, really need to get an internship while I'm in college. And that's Partly true, internship is a great opportunity, you know, to um, get practical experience, to kind of experiment and see um, if, some, if that's the uh, area that you really want to focus in your career. But in reality, uh, if you didn't get an internship, experience can still be attained by a um, part-time job, right? By having a full-time job or by engaging in volunteering activities student leadership opportunities, uh, getting um, connected with uh, different clubs, student organizations in the U, right? So what employers are really looking for is uh, experience. And experience comes in many different shapes or forms. So as, lo as long as you have something to put on your resume, you're good. So please don't obsess <laughs> over internships and think very broadly of where you can get that experience. And that could be done through independent projects if you're working um, you know, in your personal, during your personal time or something that you uh, collaborate on with your classmates. Those are all great experiences that could be included uh, to your resume. So just a very uh, quick recap. There are things that you could be doing right now to get you closer to your desired career. That's knowing yourself, trying to understand and evaluate your experiences that you're having uh, in school. Also making connections, starting conversations, getting to know people and getting out there uh, to get yourself exposed uh, to those events that eventually get you hired. Um, as I said, uh, we are still operating the Career Center just like other uh, entities on campus are uh, operating fully online um, and the quality of and the quality and the number of services is still the same as if we were, um, you know, physically on campus. So if you want to have your documents, your resume or, or your cover letter 
um, reviewed, you can just email them to our email, resume reviews at careers.utah.edu. If you have um, some brief questions that you want to get answers, uh, career-related questions, feel free to, um, to uh, drop by our virtual career studio. For more um, in-depth conversations, like if you aren't sure uh, what, um, what career you want to pursue, feel free to make an appointment with a coach uh, through our website, careers.utah.edu. And finally, as I said, keep track of all the events, career-related events that are happening on campus through Handshake. Handshake is our internal system where you can find wonderful internships and jobs and career-related events that are happening on campus and outside of campus. Uh, now, a great thing about Handshake is that uh, all jobs and internships that you can see on Handshake uh, are posted by companies that are looking specifically for University of Utah students. So you immediately have an advantage over you know, other people who are applying for those opportunities. Uh, and the two most important sections in the Handshake is events and jobs. So make sure you check those out. Um, those are great resources that you uh, will need uh, to be utilizing the next couple years of your school. Uh, you can access Handshake uh, by uh, going to utah.joinhandshake.com or simply through your CAS uh, profile. Uh, you typically get access to Handshake uh, within two weeks after you register for classes. Uh, so be patient, you still didn't get that. Um, and uh, you already have an account there, so you don't need to create one. You have an account because you are a University of Utah student. Uh, so while I'm hoping to see you all um, in person, to meet you all in person in our wonderful space on campus, uh, we are still here to support you remotely uh, with any career-related questions or concerns that you have. Even if you don't even know where to start, come see us, make an appointment. We'll be happy to assist you with any questions that you have. So let us know um, if you have any questions, feel free to email us, make an appointment, drop by our virtual career studio. I'm looking forward to meeting you all. Thank you.